Hi, it's Lizzie Williamson here with your two minute method. This one is making chocolate and I'm a mum, so when I have friends over for dinner, it's very rare that I've actually prepped any dessert or anything like that. And this is one of my favorite party tricks. In the middle of a dinner party, I can come over and whip up some chocolate, which everyone loves to watch, whack it in the freezer, and 10 minutes later, it is ready to serve. So what we do is start off with some cacao. So grab about a, um, I don't know, let's see, about four or five tablespoons of cacao, whack it in there, there we are, and then you've got your cocoa butter, same deal, about four or five tablespoons of that, and I find even if it's not melted, doesn't even matter, still works. Uh, who's got time to melt cocoa butter? So stir all that in. And then I love to add in a whole lot of other stuff, you know, like um, coconut, some pumpkin seeds, goji berries, and some nuts. But before I do, I'll just pop in a bit of honey as well, just so that can all mix up together. A couple of tablespoons of honey. Lovely, so mix all that up and Chop up some almonds, some macadamians, some nuts of your choosing, and then you're gonna mix all those in. Oh wow, that is looking so good, yum oh. All right, so chop up some nuts here. And um, yeah, people find it quite amazing that you can make chocolate, and it's so, so super easy. Pop in the almonds. I'm going to pop in some goji berries, some pumpkin seeds, a bit of shredded coconut there. And I am also um, love grating a little bit of ginger in there too. It tastes really, really good. So you can just pop in whatever you have handy with this chocolate. And this is some beautiful, rich, dense chocolate there. Oh, so good. Maybe whack in some macadamia nuts as well. Get all those there. And you just want to pop this on a plate that goes in the freezer. Put some baking paper down. There. And get this chocolate. And spread it on out. Yeah. Here we go. So pop that down. Spread it all out. Oh man, that looks amazing. And really, you only need a tiny bit of this each because it's so beautiful, rich, and ah, so Moorish. There we go. So yeah, and you know, if you ever get a sugar craving or anything like that, you can just whip up your own chocolate. Super, super easy. And you'll hardly need any of it to satisfy your cravings. But do try this little party trick uh, next time you have friends over for dinner. Okay, hope you enjoy that and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm. Into the freezer.